And lights go out for race two here at the street circuit at Norris Ring with uh, Gary Papet, Daniel Juncadea and Lucas Auer all fighting right in the early stages with Paul DiResta also and Eduardo Mortara who will take a look at the inside. But Marco Wittmann was a man on a mission straight away right on the outside of Eduardo Mortara but three abreast almost doesn't go on the exit of uh, turn number two, the Grundig turn. Daniel Juncadea then uh, seeing off the charges and challenges uh, from Lucas Auer. A bit of a lock up from Paul DiResta as they make their way through the Scholaresses for the first time of asking the two BMWs of Bruno Spengler and Marco Wittmann at that point were together and as you can see both of them going through on the inside of Eduardo Mortara so Bruno Spengler in uh, the uh, number seven BMW and two-time DTM champion the local boy Marco Wittmann then in uh, the number 11 car right alongside Edo Mortara but would have the inside line on the out of the uh, Choloresses which was exactly what was needed uh, they run off the tarmac and onto the paved concrete area as they head down towards the Dutzendijk turn as Edo Mortara was coming back at uh, Marco Wittmann now and Paul DiResta and Nico Muller and Timo Glock also to try and join in the fun but it was uh, Bruno Spengler that would head this pack for the moment. Uh, Daniel Juncadea though in the lead with uh, Lucas Auer and then Marco Wittmann to the outside of uh, Lucas Auer in the all-gold Mercedes-Benz and Marco very nearly squeezed right into the concrete barriers but gets past the uh, Austrian driver Lucas Auer in the number 22 Mercedes-Benz so Marco Wittmann's charge was already underway. Here we can see uh, Marco Wittmann then lining up the car of uh, Daniel Juncadea and going through on the inside. So the uh, local BMW driver lives just a few kilometers from this uh, Norris Ring circuit on the inside of the number 23 Mercedes Benz through the Scholar S's and down towards the uh, Dutzendijk turn. So Marco Wittmann leading Daniel Juncadea, Edo Mortara, Lucas Auer and uh, Bruno Spengler. So big breaking into the Dutzendijk turn and then one of the battles of the races between the uh, two campaigners, Timo Glock and Gary Paffett. There were several love taps, that's for sure, as they uh, kissed each other metaphorically and uh, the uh, panels between the two of them were polished on either car. Marco Wittmann though, he was showing great polish and great poise in terms of his uh, driving ability, precisely why he is a two-time DTM champion and uh, was going to head uh, Edo Mortara and Daniel Juncadea to take a home win. For the first time at the Norris Ring, Marco Wittmann would be on the top step of the podium.